Right, this is a replication of the recent video by Mario Civic. I hope I've got his name right. The Magnet Kicker. And uh, really, I've done this one for Nate as well because he's had trouble spinning his rotors. Uh, so here we are at 6 volts. One funny thing is you can hear the coils, they sing. Um, it does take a little starting at 6, but starts much better at 12 volts. But the, the note will change when it does start up. You can hear that. I put the uh, I put it near as you can hear it. Sounds a bit like bugs at night time here in Oklahoma. So it hopefully is uh, simple enough to follow there. Um, I've got an IRF 630. All of this comes from an old PC monitor. The IRF 630, and I've got. Uh, the pickup coil there, which comes from a PC uh, monitor board as well, as does the powering coil, which is a multi-strand, but it's simply connected at both ends, no fancy wiring going on. However, it all does sing, which is rather strange. As I say, this is at 12 volts. Now, the other interesting thing here is, if I bump all this up to 12, you'll hear the singing increase, but the rotor speed doesn't. very little change on the rotor speed but the singing changes back down to 6 volts there we are so uh, hopefully this is of help uh, what we've got is the positive wire there which goes to one side of one coil and to one side of the other coil uh, what else have we got we've got the, uh, the feedback from this that goes to trigger the transistor and here we are with the output wire from the IRF630, the middle one which goes to the other side of the drive coil